Hey guys! So tonight we have a really fun grocery haul. There, where'd you go, Devin? I told Devin, I said, do you want to take a video with me? Oh, he's, he's hiding. So we have a really fun grocery haul today. You guys are not going to see like a whole lot of produce or meat because we have um, a bunch of meat already and we have um, produce and stuff. I just picked up like a few extra things today, but you're not going to see a whole lot of that. It's more, I wanted to stock up on baking supplies because I think the stores are kind of getting picked through again or they're thinking that that's going to happen. And I just kind of got some random stuff for our freezer and just ingredients to bake with. I love to bake for the season, so I just really wanted to get stocked up on stuff. So I'm gonna show you guys the cold stuff okay, first. So over here, I got this big thing of the spring mix. I thought I've got some chicken and stuff in the refrigerator, some of those like grilled and ready strips. So I think I'm gonna do some salads for like some lunches and um, maybe a salad one night for dinner. I got Hayden a thing of strawberries because he's been really liking strawberries. I got also Hayden a pack of blueberry yogurt. And then back here, I got him some more little freezer pancakes. I like to have these because they're really easy in the morning to just pop in the microwave, especially if we're leaving or on the go. I can put them in his little snack cup. Then down here for the freezer, I thought these would just be nice for my husband and my lunch sometimes, or maybe just an easy dinner when you don't feel like cooking, or maybe I'm out and my husband doesn't want to cook. These are the bean and cheese great value burritos, and these are the El Monterey um beef and bean and green, green chili burritos. So I thought those would be good. Then Devin picked up a pack of these Tina's breakfast burritos. He's never tried these, but they looked really good and there's 12 of them in there. So I've been making him some breakfast casserole, but I thought um, these would be kind of good to change it up because he's probably getting, are you getting sick of breakfast casserole, honey? Um, also, guys, we have decorated for Christmas. You guys are going to see a very thorough video on that after this video. But yeah, so anyways, I've got some bananas back there that I need to make banana bread out of, by the way. And then over here, I just got another big bag of shredded cheese. I got this buffalo chicken dip because I saw something like this at Aldi the other day and really wanted to try it. And it was also kind of keto friendly. I haven't, I'm not doing keto, but... Um, I've been like trying a few like different things that were kind of low carb. So that's kind of a good snack. Then I got one of these to try for Hayden. I don't know if he's going to eat this or not, but I thought it could be kind of a neat little like lunchtime snack. I got some, I need to get these things in the freezer. I got some frozen triple chocolate cookie dough at Walmart. It says this is new and I've never seen this before and I thought they looked so good. So we're going to make those one night when we want something sweet for the season. And then we got a frozen pizza because we haven't bought a frozen pizza in forever. Then back here, I got two of these little keto vanilla yogurt. These are really good, by the way, if you ever want to try those. Very good. Some more orange juice, a thing of butter. If you guys have been on my channel a while, you know I like this Zatarain's pasta. We, Me and my husband were just saying we haven't bought this in forever. So that'll be a quick and easy dinner one night. I got some biscuits just to have in the freezer. Sometimes I like to make sausage gravy or just maybe to have like a jelly biscuit in the morning or whatever. And a bag of corn for the freezer because we don't, I don't think we really have any corn. So that's the cold stuff. And then I'm going to put this away quick because it's been out for a little bit. And then we'll get into that Guys, stuff. I'm going to go through this stuff kind of quick because my phone is dying but this is all the stuff that's non-refrigerated so back here I'll start up here first I got a small thing of mouthwash because we needed some I got a thing of the banana organic bananas for Hayden and a couple honey crisp apples and then this is kind of some of my stuff for baking so starting here I got some white chocolate baking chips I got some semi-sweet baking chips, which I have more semi-sweet and like peanut butter ones in my pantry, but I just wanted to get stocked up. I got some little milk chocolate, little Hershey Kisses that are the Santa hats. Those are so cute. Some plain little Christmas M&Ms. And then down here, some of the Brock's little chocolate stars. I think I'm going to make some of those little cookies with those. Then... I got a new bag of brown sugar, a new bag of powdered sugar, because I needed to kind of, I think my brown sugar is still good, but I need some fresh powdered sugar. I got a bag of sugar, 
Back here, if you guys ever watch The Moss Family, they made these the other day and I thought they sounded so good. And my husband, our little tradition is we make pancakes and bacon every Sunday. So these are cinnamon roll pancake and waffle mix and it comes with the icing. So I thought that was really cool. And then here's some Funfetti cake. I thought I would make that one day. They're also for just upcoming events. Like my aunt normally has a little Christmas get together. I have a Christmas get together. So I thought about making a little Funfetti cake. I thought that would be kind of fun. And then back here, I got another one, but I got this blue and I thought that was so pretty. But honey, I just realized I didn't get any icing. Oh, <laughs> I have to get, or I can just always make icing, but I like this one whipped icing I've showed you guys in videos before. So I thought if I have a little small Christmas get together at my house, I might make one and maybe make one for my aunt's house. So we'll see. I'll have it on hand. I got some corn syrup in case I need that for recipes, one can of sweetened condensed, condensed milk just to have on hand, and one can of evaporated milk. I wanted to just have some things so if I do decide like I want to bake something, I should have all the ingredients. And I got a huge bag of flour to add to what I have. And then I got these really cute holiday tree marshmallows. We've got like the little, with our Keurig over there, we have the little hot chocolate K-cups. So I thought those would be really, really fun. Excited about those. Then over here, I have a little Christmas little Jello Jiggler mold that you make like little Santas or different things out of Jello. So I got some little festive colors. Let's see, you guys. There we go. I phone wasn't focusing but let's see there we go I got some little lime jello it's for green and red and I got the strawberry for the red I thought that would be really fun then down here I got Hayden a box of mandarin oranges these little cups are just easy so I got some of those I got some little pretzels to bake with I thought about putting like the little M&Ms on there and melting those I got these Stauffer shortbread cookies they are the bomb guys so good and then I got some blue corn tortilla chips for me with my dip I got Hayden another box of these apple cinnamon granola bars he loves those my husband loves these gingerbread cakes I was like pick which one would be your favorite because I want to put some on my little Christmas plate back there so those will be really cute then I got Hayden just a few more of these to add to our pantry sweet potato apple and pumpkin and sweet potato mango and kale I know these are baby food but they're a really nice way to like sneak in some vegetables for him I got one more pack of taco seasoning one pack of ramen noodles just in case I want that for lunch one day I got a pack of these creamy garlic shells they just sounded really good and I have a bunch of chicken so I thought one night for an easy dinner that would be good Devin picked out another thing of the Welch's strawberry jelly I got a can of refried beans um one more box of noodles because I don't really think we have any which I just just thought I should have got these at um Kroger because this stuff is on sale right now if you want to stock up Kroger was having like a buy 10 save and like it was making noodles and stuff 50 cents so that was a good place to stock up this week and then I got Hayden another big box of oatmeal because he loves oatmeal sometimes he even has it for dinner because he loves it I got this little thing of these chocolate rice cakes for an easy snack I thought these would be good with peanut butter spread on them then I got a loaf of butter bread and some little peanut butter crackers for my husband's lunch so yeah that was just kind of random like I said it wasn't really a lot of like meal things it was more mainly to go to stock up my baking supplies and just kind of some random items Hayden needed a couple things my husband needed a few things so yeah this was just kind of big but small in a sense because a lot of it's just preparation for like weeks down the road so thank you guys so much for watching um let me know in the comments if you guys are getting your holiday stuff started if you guys are stocking up on baking supplies or maybe you're starting to get thanksgiving stuff which i need to get on the stick with but thank you guys so much for watching please like and subscribe to this video um will like this video and subscribe to the channel i appreciate every single one of you guys thank you so much